Hey guys, this is Fulton Spy, and in this video I'll be giving you some tips on how to be a better rat. This type of killer is the best choice to play against new players, because they're gonna have a hard time dealing with not knowing where he is, until it's almost too late. So first off, this type of killer can cloak, becoming almost completely invisible. You can do this by holding down the mouse 2 button. This will also give away your location by the sound of bells ringing. If you can't attack, jump over obstacles or destroy them while being cloaked. But on the other hand, survivors will not hear the heartbeat sound when you're close to them while being cloaked. If you want to interact or attack, you will have to uncloak first. And this takes a couple of seconds and you will make a lot of noise with the bells going off. So any survivors you are stalking will instantly know you're there. Even though, if you're cloaked, the survivors will not hear the heartbeat sound until you uncloak. What I found that works the best for me is trying to sneak up on the survivors working on the generators. Decloak as close to them as possible, and your speed advantage might give you the upper hand to the chase. Keep in mind, this might not work against better players, as they might spot the cloak, or run away and hide before you can start the chase. A good player will keep running through obstacles, hoping you will give up eventually. Do not waste your time on these players, because you won't be able to catch them, and you will waste your time while the other survivors can start up the generators. Move on and find a better victim to catch, or follow the scratches survivors leave behind when they run. As you can see here guys, I hit one of the survivors and he makes the getaway. Usually at this point I like to cloak again, so they will not hear the heartbeat when I'm close, giving me a chance to surprise them. But I got a bit lucky following the trails to leave behind while running. This is obviously a new player, he probably doesn't know that the running leaves a very clear path for the killer to follow, so hiding nearby just after the run is a very bad idea. The red does feel a little bit faster than the other killers. But the cloaking slows him down for about 3 seconds. People say it's overpowered, and that may be true, but on the other hand, he can't attack while he decloaks, giving the survivor some very well needed time to make a getaway. Anyway, guys, that's about it for this video. Let me know in the comments what you think, and I'll see you on the next one. Thank you.